Hi everyone, this is Mike at Brash Monkey, and this quick tip tutorial is going to show you Spriter's great new feature that allows you to batch export your animations for each character variation or visual variation you've created through character maps. I'll be sure in the description below to provide a link to a previous tutorial that shows you how to uh, save character map stack files, or basically characters, which are whatever active character maps you have going, you can save them to files and then reload them. So uh, I'm just going to assume you know how to do that and continue with this tutorial. So let's say I've created several characters uh, using this uh, RPG Heroes art pack and I want to export out the uh, full sprite sheet and the portrait for each of the characters all at once. Um, you can now do that with Spriter, and here's how. So the first thing we're going to do is choose File, Export Animation to PNG or GIF, and then um, we're going to make sure the settings are correct. In this case, uh, we're going to Batch Export, and I'm going, going to expand this so we can see the list of files a bit better. I'm going to deselect everything and just choose the full sprite sheet for now. and. Um, I'm going to pick sprite sheet, uh, sprite strip or sheet, um, and in this case, I know I need three for the horizontal frames. And uh, make sure all of your other settings are correct. In this case, I do want to set to animation preset, which I described in a previous uh, quick tip video. So that's all good, but what I need to do now that I know my settings are all good is to tell it that it's going to do a batch for any specific number of SCMS files. Those are the character uh, map files that I created. So I'm going to go to my desktop and I created a folder for that. So I have, I'm going to multi-select all three, choose open, and then I'm going to choose batch export and I'll save it on the desktop and we'll call it character underscore that will be sort of the base file name and I'll click save. So as you can see it's applying each of the different character maps and creating the sprite sheet for each of those. And now if I open up any of them there you'll see one sprite sheet um, for one of the characters and the other sprite sheet for the other characters. In this one, I forgot in the character map to turn off the uh, guide image for the cropping, which is why that's showing up there. But don't worry if you make sure your character map hides that specific image, that won't happen. And here's the other one. So as you can see, you can very quickly um, create and tweak uh, as many characters as you want and then in one fell swoop uh, batch export all of the uh, sprite sheets you need for all of the characters. And that's it. I hope this was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.